Good morning and happy Monday and welcome to day number 29 of my 30 days to health. Now unknowingly over the last 29 days I've become an expert at gluten free porridge and I would like to share with you my findings. So first of all we've got the Tesco own brand gluten wheat and milk free porridge oats. Second up, we have the Narin's gluten-free Scottish porridge oats. And then finally, we have Bob's Red Mill gluten-free oats, pure traditional. Now, first of all, the price, Tesco, two pounds, Narin, two pounds, Bob's, four pounds. So let's start with the worst. It's the Tesco own brand. Now the problem with the Tesco own brand, obviously they all taste a little similar, but if you have a look, it's like cut. If you just have a look at the actual oats there, they're very small. So once you've got that mixed in with your porridge, um, uh, the, the milk or the water or whatever you're having with it, it's quite like ready break, you know, it's just like you're eating mush. So it's nice and it's gluten free, so that's the first advice. The next one is the Narin's one, which of course Narin's is a very uh, famous name in the health world. And again, if you have a look at the consistency, it's a little bit bigger than the Tesco one, um, but it's still not the whole oat. Then, we move to Bob's. Now, this is the most expensive one. This was at twice the price, but you can see straight away, these really are whole oats. So you're getting massive, chunky oats. Um, and this is what I've got this morning in my porridge. Now, in my porridge, my favorite way to make it is add the chocolate protein and then top it with fresh strawberries. And this, is gorgeous, absolutely delicious. Um, and this is one of the things that will be taking forward after my 30 days and really, really enjoying in the morning, chocolate protein porridge. So that was my quick review of the porridge oats. If you've tried any other brands, there's one more brand I want to try, and that is of course the Quaker gluten-free. Uh, a lot of them are not available, that is the only problem. So that is uh, my review. If you know of any other porridge oats gluten-free, please, please let me know, guys. I'd love to try them out. Um, and I'll see you again tonight for another video. Bye for now. Thank you for joining me.